Hi there, bonjour, and thanks for watching. This video covers the options and features specific to creating Canadian EFT files using ACH Universal. We recommend watching our other videos for general information on importing data and integrating with QuickBooks. Enter the ACH Universal account you want to work with and select Canadian EFT Setup on the Home tab. Start by checking the Activate Canadian Format checkbox. Select your bank, and this will configure the file format layout and populate your destination data center ID. If your bank is not listed, select the All Other Banks option and enter your five-digit destination data center. Please note, each bank has a link to the right to a bank-specific help page. In the next section, enter your company information, which includes your short company name up to 15 characters, your full company name, your 10-digit company ID, which will be supplied by your bank, your bank account number, and your nine-digit financial institution number. Your financial institution number will be supplied by your bank and will be a zero plus your three-digit institution number followed by your five-digit branch ID. This number is the equivalent of a U.S. ABA routing number. The EFT files you create are assigned a sequential file creation number, sometimes referred to as an FCN. This helps banks identify duplicate files. While ACH Universal creates, tracks, and increments these numbers once you're up and running, you may need to make an entry here for testing or your first file depending on your bank. If you need to reset the file creation number, enter the number here and click Reset. If your bank requires a value during testing, enter it here. Most users can skip the Other Codes section as these are generally standard settings. Further down this screen, there are sections specific to certain banks. Enter a login or header record here if needed. TD Bank supports a proprietary 80-byte format and it can be selected here. Enter a settlement account or origination count here if needed. Be sure to click OK at the bottom of the screen to save your work. As a reminder, each large bank has a link to the right to a bank-specific help page with full documentation. Congratulations! You're finished with the Canadian setup. Mm -hmm.